Good evening, my dear students. Welcome to my new chapter. And this is for class 12 student. And the chapter is very important from the examination point of view. And this is Indigo. And if you have not subscribed my YouTube channel, I have given you the link. Please subscribe. You will be getting benefited because Indigo chapter as this is one of the longest chapters in your syllabus. So I'll be breaking it into five different parts so that uh, you can understand it in a better way and segmentize so that it will be very easier for you to understand. My thing is that you should know the uh, core of this chapter so that you can answer the questions very nicely and fluently. And always remember, in your examination, you try to answer it with brief sentences. Break the sentences. Don't uh, write a very long sentence. And that will be very tiresome for you also. So, uh, uh, write very small sentences to the point and try to be simple. Okay. So, let's start Indigo. Now, first thing is, what is indigo? When we heard about the word indigo, it comes into our mind about what we call nil. And this chapter is of pre-independence era. Means Amar Dekhon Sadin Huar Agor Homar Kotha Aru Zihetu Amar Dekhon Sadin Huar Agor Homar Kotha That Ki Hoi Sile he bikhe ami e chapter to janim eta dangor incident hoisile mahatma gandhi e jot koi problem to solve koribo logia hoisile aru e chapter to likise lui fisher a lui fisher ok kwa hoy je one of the uh, best biographer on mahatma gandhi mohandas karamchand gandhi so let's start the chapter himalayar padeshot at the foothills of Himalaya, near the kingdom of Nepal, Nepal or Rajdhani Rusorot, in Bihar, Bihar Rajot, Hekomot, Hekomot, Bharat Bulikole, Tumaloke Monotakiba, Bangladesh, Pakistan, India. Now, all three countries were together and that was called Bharat Ba India. Aru, Tat, Ekon, district Asile Namasile, Champaran. Remember, the entire episode of this Indigo chapter is about Champaran. So, Champaranot Kisman estate asile. Like uh, nowadays, you know about the tea estates. So, all the estates were owned by Britishers because that time British rule was there in India. So, a British, British Arabic like Zetia asile, Tianluko kwa asile, landlords. So landlords pila ke ki kori sile, nizay kheti no kore. The Indian tenants, means Indian zibu farmer sile, tiyan luke ki kori sile, tat kheti kori sile. And kheti korar babot, tiyan luke ki suman kore di bo lagi sile, ar kore to ki di bo lagi sile, tiyan luke di bo lagi sile, indigo crop rui pelai. Indigo te tiyan crop asile, ajikal ami nil, zito artificial nil to ami dekha pao, hei komot hei to na sile, Nilor, Indigo, Keti Koribolagisle, or Keti Kori, He to Tiai Lui Ply, Hukuai, Tak Horu Horuke Kati, Tak Ako Hukuai, Guri Kori, Tapra, Nil Utpadon Hoisle, He to connect our costing, cost of production, Zito Amiazical Co, COP, Bohut Pesi Asile. Aru, Tianoke Kikosle, fifteen per cent of their land. Suppose Iman Kini Mati Dile, Tar. 15% of the land should be planted with indigo and entire 15% crop should be given to the British landlords. He to ask let look for tax. Ar baki kini mati, 85% mati ten look for zisa take koribo parisile. Now the, the thing was going on smoothly, not very smoothly because we know the British uh, you know, landlords used to dominate them used to torture them and the condition of the sharecroppers that is called sharecropping 
process. So the condition of the sharecroppers were very, 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 very poor. And that was also going on nicely, smoothly. And we know the Britishers were very intelligent. And so somehow they came to know that in Germany, artificial indigo has been produced. Germany ki hoisle eta artificial indigo produce korisle jar cost of production mane tak toyar korte jitu kharosa hoy hetu kom hoisile ar kom hoa karane kom namot biki koribo parisile and this news has been come to the british landlords and immediately kintu indian bilake jonan asile because in champaran indian tenants were so poor that they did not have any education they were illiterate so british bilake ahi indian peasants bilako kolehi je tumaloke next year pra aru indigo share cropping koribo na lage but e indigo share cropping to nokara loge loge ki hobo teoloke alop toka dibo lagibo and they have demanded money and if somehow the Indian tenants will not fulfill their demand, they have started torturing them. And this was the situation in Champaran sharecropping and this was becoming a big problem. So let me stop for now and I will be explaining what happened after that in my next video. Thank you for listening to me.